Denise Whiskey, fantastic um, trio, good coaches, and it's a fantastic football club. I think he's changed the style as well. That's the most impressive thing to me. You go into a football club, it takes you 18 months to change a style from Tony Pulis to Mark Hughes. Very he's actually, different style. Right? He's actually done it straight away in terms of a more progressive passing style. And like I say, I, I think he's got another another step up in terms of jobs, uh, Mark Hughes. And Philip, Tottenham, one winning six, Europa League. It, you know, obviously a lot depends on mm. the cup final. Are they better off out of it? I mean, they don't seem to perform so well, well in the league when they're in it. I think they're playing like they don't want to be in the Europa <laughs> League next year. They've conceded 53 goals this season. I look at the Spurs side, they've got good front players, they've got good midfield players. The centre-backs, for me, have got a soft centre. They've got a brilliant goalkeeper, they've got two young full-backs. The two centre-backs in the summer, I think he needs to improve. It, it, is that the one area you, you would like to... to yeah, you know, I think they, they haven't kept that many clean sheets this year, so I agree with Philip, you know, a couple of centre-backs and, yeah... Definitely get two setbacks. Okay, we'll see what happens in the summer. Uh, we'd also, uh, by the way, like to add our best wishes to uh, Jimmy Greaves from everyone connected uh, with Match of the Day. Um, hopefully, he'll get well soon. Uh, three straight defeats have stalled Manchester United's momentum under Louis van Gaal, but they remain on course for a top four finish. United travelled to Crystal Palace, who themselves have lost their last three. At Selhurst Park, Steve Wilson.